Hello everyone. So I was watching some of my favorite streamers do streaks on the Chaos Shuffle and I was like, why not? Let me give this a try. And oh boy, oh boy. For someone that has never done a streak before, like myself, and I'm on console by the way, it was a lot harder than I expected. I lost it four times at least. The first time was at 26. The second time I lost it on my fifth game. The third time I lost it at 35. And the fourth time I lost it was 21. And after so many tries and failed, I finally got it. For those of you who don't know, like on console we only have 60 FPS, so it's a bit harder to play killer. Plus you play on the controller. It's easier, like everyone I know that plays on PC says it's easier to play on mouse and keyboard than the controller when they play killer. So the rules really quickly. I have to get 50 wins in a row and a win is defined by getting 3 kills or 4 kills. If they do all the gens and 2 people escape, that is a loss and I have to reset the, the streak. If one person escapes to the hatch, that doesn't count as a loss. I just wanted to keep it very simple, if I get 3 kills, it's a win. If I get any less than that, it's a loss and I have to reset this, this streak from 0. I play the majority of the killers and yes, I could have done this with spirit and this would have been a lot easier than it, than it was but I decided to go with Wesker and have it be a bit more challenging and it really was challenging. For someone that has 6000 hours and like myself that is quite bored of playing just normal public games I have to say this trick was so so much fun to do. Like I've been grinding it since the third day of the Chaos Shuffle and I got it just on the last day. And I learned so much on Wesker by doing this trick. Now obviously because this was Chaos Shuffle there is no build to show you guys because every build I got was random. And I think that's why I think that's why it was so fun because every single match was with a different build. But the add-ons I went with is I restricted myself to green, the quality, like I can't go over green, and I went with the egg. If you don't know what the egg does is, on Wesker, when you use the first dash, the time between the first and the second dash is longer, you can hold it longer. The second add-on I went with is the beetle. The beetle makes you throw survivors faster when you grab them with your dash. It's easier to zone people with it, although I think the egg overall is a better choice. But you can see me swapping back and forth between them, the egg and the beetle. And for the offerings, I used the hatch spawns in the main building, I think, just so the matches will go quicker and I don't have to. I don't have to look for the hatch if I have happen to kill three people. And that's the only reason I used it to just speed things up, because I was doing this non-stop. Uh, because the chaos shuffle is only one week, and I really wanted to get this take and within a week before the chaos shuffle was done. I got two sick games for you guys watching this video. One where I almost lost because I was doing so many mistakes. I was playing for a long time and I was getting really tired and I should have gone to sleep but I kept on playing and I, I did so many mistakes and I almost lost it. But somehow I came back and won the game. And the next game was where I lost at 35 win streak. And I had to reset the streak from 35 to 0. I won't say which one is which, just to make it more exciting. I will be uploading both vaults to my YouTube channel, it should be out a day after this video is out. Before we get to the games, I just need a small favor from you guys watching. I need you to go to the link in the des description and go to my Twitch to see the vault. Just because I'm not an affiliate on Twitch and the vault will disappear within a week. Both of the vaults are recorded right after each other. I played 25 games, won all of them, went to sleep, the next day I did the same thing. Please confirm when you have seen the VODs, thank you so much. I just I just don't want the future people to come here on the video and click on the link in the description and then they see that there is no VOD and there is unfortunately nothing I can do about it. With all this out of the way, let's get to the games. I hope you enjoy. Alright, not my favorite map. I think it's a bit too huge but I think we should be fine. Let's see what we got. We got Tinker, Rapid Brutality, Gearhead, and Pentimento. Mm. Pentimento might be a bit of a waste, but the other three perks are gonna be okay. Need to find this first survivor. The thing that I don't like about this map is a big, it's a bit too huge in my opinion. 
I know it doesn't have the best balance, but the size of it is kind of insane. Okay, hello, Steve. Okay, free hit. You can see the 5% from Mappage Brutality. Oh. Alright, easy first down. I'm trying to see somebody with gearhead but I find it really hard to see people with gearhead because the gen's O is also red and the O of the survivors are red as well which makes it so hard to see if somebody's actually on the gen unless they are working on the side of it get the free tag on oh, on Ash We have a Tinker popping. I want. I think the undetectable messed up with him a bit because he. I didn't. I didn't have red stain because of Tinker was up. Mm, I don't make it in time. I think this map has a lot of pallets as well, maybe I should not use my power as often and try to just get them once. Some of these pallets are quite unsafe. Oh, that's so unlucky. How did that not hit? Like, I threw him on the rock. What the fuck? Whatever. Get him anyway. Ideally, I want to go for Steve, but can she greet the pallet? Get rid of the pallet, and I'm gonna try to get out my power. Never mind, there's too many orcs in the way. Get the M1. Like, I feel so much easier to just play M1 on this map. Oh, fuck. That's a bit embarrassing. Get her now, maybe. No, she makes it the pallet. If I don't get her soon, I think I will have to leave her for now. Damn it. She's winning all the 50-50s. <laughs> I have to leave her, I have to leave her. I'm gonna lose this game otherwise. That gen's about to pop. Like we are actually on two gens already. I should not have chased her, I should have just gone for the Steve. I know Ash was there but I was looking for the Steve to be honest. He doesn't seem to be here. <sighs> I have a tinker, that's not good at all. You disappoint me. This man does best. Hey. Ah. 
Like I'm chasing too many people. I think I need to stick on two. And another one. This isn't looking good. Like I really don't want to chase him now, but if I go, he'll just finish the gen. I've hooked three different people already. I'll see you dead. This is the last thing I want to do when I do a streak. I should have just found the Steve from the start, but... That mistake might come back to haunt me now. I'm gonna go back and try to find him and get the Alan Wake out of the game. Because we are two gens and the gens on the father are probably working on it as well. So realistically we are at one gen soon. Oh my god, where did they go? The thing is I don't want them to get progress on that gen. And then you have the one the main building. Yeah, I want this gen because this is close to my free gen. Please be the Alan Way. No, that's the Steve. The, the Steve's not even death hook though, he's on his second now if I hook him. Oh, this is so bad. Okay, thought I would use the second dash, but I didn't. The problem is he's, he's not dead though. I need someone dead. Oh my god, this is so close to popping. And I don't... Oh. This is very bad. I, I'll just go for the Steve and kill him. I need to take someone out of the game now. I'll give him the gen. Because if I go to the other gen, they will finish this one. Where did they go? Somebody is here. Oh, there you go. He is Deathhawk, I believe. He he must be Deathhawk. We are at one gen. This is this is game number eight, by the way. If I lose this, I have to reset again, and I already reset the stake at 35. Uh, we're at 1, Jen. God damn it. I need to find the Steve, like he hasn't even healed the whole time. Where is he? I think she has balance because she dropped with no sound. Could be wrong though. The good thing I have a bit of th of a th region here. Uh. I heard someone drop. I don't want to chase her, I don't want to chase her, no, no. I need to get Steve. I 
I guess I'm in it for the long game. I'm, I'll just wait till they do a mistake. That's my only option here, probably. If I go on a chase, like one of these gents will get done. Oh, why would you do that, Steve? What the hell? Okay, that's a huge mistake. This should secure the game. Now I just need to find one person, hook them and literally just stand from front of the hook. Because my win condition is to get a 3k and that's it. They can do all the gens and get one out, that's completely fine. Just need to find someone, like literally. Okay, there she is. Just hook her and st stay on the hook if I have to. Let's see if I can mind game her. No, she's too good. The downside of having of having rabbit rabbit brutality is that you don't get blood loss. So, like this this chase can take ages if needs to be. I only need to catch her, and that's it. Nice. Uh, that was really close to. I was very close to losing that. Oh, I can see him with Gearhead getting the locker. <laughs> I can see him. Well, he's dead. He isn't the other one. Gearhead value. Let's go. Yeah, and that's where I get the focus then. Like, if Steve didn't do that mistake, and like he was injured crouching next to the gen, if he didn't do that, imagine how this how this game would be. That's crazy. We got an okay map, I guess. When you spawn here, survivors have always a, a chance to spawn on the other side of the shack, on that gen over there. Let's see if, have, if they have spawned there. The chance is quite high. Yeah, I can see a bird flying. Two of them spawned here. That's a really good guess by me. See if you can get him with the power. Nice. Easy first down. Somebody else was here. I wonder where they went. I can still see the scotch marks. Oh, there he is. See if I can get him infected. Nice. He should be down. No, he has a pallet. Put him down, breaking it. He fell for it. Can I get him here? Mm, 
Nice. Very easy to down so far, but they did a gen already. That's what happens when we don't have corrupt. Especially in a decently decently sized map like this one. Nice. See if I can get him get to him maybe. Drop the pallet. What the fuck, this hook is broken. <laughs> I'm gonna leave this Huey if I don't get her soon though, because I'm wasting way too much time on her. She doesn't fall for me putting it to break the ballot. She is quite decent. Come on, egg. Nah. Bro, the shield is doing, winning all the 50 50s. Give it one more chance if I don't get to leave her. Oh my. Alright, thank god. That hook is broken, is it just bugged or something? I'm not sure. Why is it broken? Like, I didn't hear a notification for anyone breaking it. We got a pretty garbage build as well, by the way. I have no clue why that hook is broken, but sure. Stuff the boon. Okay, Steve is who I want. Just get them on on him. 5% faster with rapid brutality though. I'd have liked to get him infected, but that's fine. Come on the hook. Man, I really don't think I should be going for so many different people. Let's see if this is a quick down though. If not, I'll leave and go back to for Steve. Rapid brutality. Oh, she fell for it. Nice. Actually, I should really go for Steve now after this, otherwise, I'm losing this game. And I'm 
I'm gonna restart the streak back to zero. Please be a quick down. Nice. Let's get you on the hook. I have a decent gen set up here though. I'm at 35 but I wouldn't mind restarting this trick but... I would prefer not to. I don't know why that hook in the middle is just gone, unusable, for some unknown reason. And now she's gonna wiggle off because of that. Yeah, I'm definitely losing this game because of this. Like, there's no hook in the middle. The game just said fuck you to me, I guess. I'll just go for you, Yui, if you really want to. Okay, I didn't want to vault. I, w I was waiting for her to vault before I use my second dash. And yeah, all the gens are done, I guess. I'm gonna lose this take because I didn't tunnel Steve. And also, there is no hook in the middle. That's another big problem this let's see if i can bring it back maybe that just sucks like the game punches you when you go for different people but if you tell one person out it's a lot easier to win like if i only tell steve this, this game I, I would have won ages ago i think I mean, I can get Steve now, but the game pretty much over. If I get a 2k here, I'm lucky. Nice. I'm pretty sure that Doe is 99 by now. Maybe they will throw though. Let's see. I really shouldn't be missing now. Maybe they throw. Okay, light body block. She wanted me to take her. She has BT, she wanted me to hit her, but I knew I knew that that's why I waited. The base kit BT. Fuck man, that sucks. I am a 35 though, but it's okay. I guess I need to just tunnel more. Oh, the hook in the middle is back. That is so weird. Yeah, the door is 99, they will open it and leave.
Definitely need to tell them more. This way it is though. They played really well though. GG to them.